there are two things that touched me, um, which made me emotional. One is when we had that demonstration at the at the hangar there, and it was about your queen. There is a, where you see it, no falter, no surrender until I'm no, I am no more. That thing really touched me, for I know what it means. If you have been just reading it, I want you now to internalize it. Talks about discipline. Talks about accountable, being accountable to the people. Talks about surprise, commitment, warriors, being vigilant. You, the answers, you are the foundation of the army. Without you, the army is as good as nothing. Discipline is your docket. UPDF is a disciplined force. We are known because of our discipline. We are what we are because of our discipline. So the things you have done here and yours, please make sure that you don't leave them here. They should not just be to show me that let them see this and it's happening. Please make sure that our soldiers do the right thing. Make sure that you get to know their problems, their challenges, and it is you to report their challenges, problems to the leadership. Because it is during the uh, mountain, that's when you get no home. Oh, this man is sick. He has a problem with his child. Oh, this and this. It is in that, that parade there. Very, very important. On behalf of Air Force, sir, and on my behalf, I'm honored this afternoon to welcome you to Uganda Air Force College. I also want to give glory to God for enabling us to reach yet another milestone in our endeavor to professionalize Air Force. I would in the same vein thank His Excellency the President of the Republic of Uganda and the Commander-in-Chief for his foresightedness and astute leadership that has made us come this far through his guidance always. Our guest of honor, sir, as the Commander has already elaborated on the achievement and progress so far attained by the College, sure a lot more work is ahead of us. The, the main objective is to build and develop this college to the standard of international military aviation schools. It is important to note that the operational readiness of Air Force depends on the serviceability of various air sets and the availability of trained personnel at different levels. For the graduate, I would like to applaud you for keeping three things. The shape, the shape for, for us in Air Force, that is discipline, hard work, and teamwork. Technically, you have been doing excellent work. Now you have been empowered with the leadership skills and ideological clarity. I can now rely on you to do your work professionally and please pass this knowledge to others. Today is again another special day of a kind as we graduate our first intake of senior issues at Uganda Air Force College. This course is in line with professionalization process uh, in UPDF. Training of personnel at this college has reduced the cost of training Air Force personnel out of the country, cost effective manageable levels, and reduced for dependency. We are gradually and steadily going to where we want to be, and we shall get there. Where there is determination, failure cannot dismantle a flag of success.